Hi guys! I got something good today. Something you're gonna like. Vegetables! And this vegetable is... is... can you guess it? We probably already got a head start. You know what it is. You read that title, huh? It's all that picture. You saw it. You know what it is. But it is very good. Another really, really good vegetable. And I love it. Okay? And I hope you love it. And I hope you love the idea that I created. And I'll tell you more about this vegetable later, too, in my video. So make sure you watch it, okay? And I'll tell you a little story, too, about these. Okay? Anyway, shall we see what we have here? We have this beautiful cucumber. Yummy, yummy, yummy. I love cucumbers. Okay? So let's see. Let's give this cucumber a little spin, okay? Let's see what he does. <laughs> Ready? Ooh. Oh, it's nice and cold because it was like in the refrigerator. It was so cold. I feel like the condensation. A lot of condensation on it. Okay, there we go. They are yummy. I love cucumbers. I love adding cucumbers to my salad, too. And um, the way I made it to you could add it to your salad, too. But I just always eat these, like, on the side with my meal or just ate them for, like, a snack or something. Which, they're good. And if you like a certain seasoning or a certain flavor, hmm... Let's see what we can do. Let's see. We gotta be careful though, okay? I don't want it to fall. <laughs> okay. Almost done. Let's see. Hear the noise? Sounds fresh, right? Did you hear the noise? And it looks nice color, nice green color. And it's yummy, it's the perfect size. Or you can have a little smaller too. They have different kind of cucumbers, but this one's pretty good too. This is the kind that we're going to use for the thing. Now with this creation that I made, my mom, oh, I can pull up. Okay, anyway, so my mom used to make these cucumbers a certain way. And um, you can leave the peelings on or off. A lot of times my mom would, would peel the cucumber too, you know, peel the skin on the cucumber. You know, cut the sides. You throw those out anyway either way you do it and or put them in your gardening which is a good thing in your soil and um she would peel it you know peel it all me i left the skin on the day and the skin has a lot of vitamins and nutrition so, and um i like the i like the outer layer of it tastes really good too uh, but she used to like um you know take all the you know peel it and then she would cut it like in slices you know, not too, not too, kind of thinner slices. And then, um, you know, cut it, cut the whole um, cucumber up. And me today, like I said, I left the peeling on and just cut it in slices the way she did. And then I get an onion. And I cut up the onion, kind of like sliced it, diced it a little bit. And then I need some vinegar. I need some water. I need some pepper. And a little bit of salt. And today I use seasoned salt. A lot of times my mom would just use the regular salt, you know. And like table salt. And then we have the creation getting ready to start up. Okay. So after we slice all this up, see what kind of size container you have. A lot of times my mom would use jars. Today I use like a little plastic little tub thing. I'll show you. And, um, you know, after she has it all cut up, put the, um, where you put the vinegar and the water in, mix it up. Um, probably like a little more vinegar than water, I would say. Um, maybe like about uh, maybe a third less water or so. Half as much water. But anyway, then you put the vinegar in there. Um, then you put um, sprinkle some pepper in there. Sprinkle some a little bit of salt, seasoned salt, whatever you like. Mix it up. Then. You add your um, cucumbers, put your cucumbers in there. Make sure you room, leave some room for those cucumbers, okay, guys? And then you put the cucumbers in there, and um, then you add a little more. And you put the onion in there, you got to put the onion. I almost forgot about that. Put the onion in there, 
mix it all up, add some more pepper, a little bit of pepper, and then mix it up, and then well, what you do is leave it in the, put it in the fridge so it gets nice and cold and kind of form in a little bit, and then um, when you take it out, you have a beautiful creation, and shall I show you what I created? My mom's the one that always made these, and I loved them. And my creation today, I'll show you what it looks like, okay? I know I try to make a decoration sometimes with my food. Anyway, so she made this for us all the time, and I always loved it. And I guess that's why I like salt and vinegar chips so much, because she made this a lot, and I love this. So every time I think about it, I try to make it all the time, along with my other vegetables I like to make, okay? So let me show you guys what I created. Oh, I felt that, okay. Anyway, hmm, okay, so here we go, okay. There's my little creation of the day, okay, see it? Hmm, are you guys getting hungry? If you can only smell the vinegar, it smells so good. Oh no, something just fell, oh well. See, here we go, guys. Okay, let me pick up my stuff. That's my fork and my napkin in case I need it, huh? Okay, we're going to put that right there. We got that right there. Okay. See? There we go. See? So we got them both right there together. And there you go. See, I put them on, um, kind of arranged them on the plate. I put like a couple little pieces of onion. That's like a little slice of onion. I don't know if you can see it. And then I put like five little slices of cucumber. And then I added a little more pepper because I love my pepper. I love pepper. It's like my favorite seasoning. I have that pepper pretty much on everything. So there we go. We got that. And we got that. See? Oh, look. There we go. Almost like a... Like Ferris wheel, kind of. I don't know if I'm doing it right, but I'm getting a little confused here. So here we go, guys. Okay. I'm going to try them. They smell so good. They smell like vinegar. And I love vinegar. I love vinegar. Okay. So... This one has a little bit of onion with it. See, I put onion on the top. See, I don't know. Can you see the onion? I think you can. Yeah, you can see it, huh? You see it? See, there you go. If you want to eat, there you go. <laughs> okay. Mmm. 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 Mmm, mmm, mmm. See, it does have a little sour, soury taste. So if you like sour, I think you're definitely going to love vinegar. Um, vinegar is really, really good. I love it. Okay. Mmm. 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 And you know it's hot right now. And, um, these would be really, really good. Take you like a, let me show you what else I got, what I did, guys. It's really hot. You know, we always got to prepare for this heat. Always, always, always. I'm going to make a video about that too, guys, because I think it's very important for everybody to be safe, okay? And... See, you could bring these little snap, see those little snap things? Like, you know, like I said before, bring your ice chest, you know, in your car or with you when you go out somewhere. And have you some water in there and some other drinks, you know, that keep you hydrated. Oh, it's spilling on me a little bit, guys, but that's okay. Vinegar is good for you. Okay, anyway, you can have, get like these little, little containers right here. Little plastic containers, they have a lid on them, but they're really handy. And you can make this. You can put. See, you can put it in there. See how I got it in there? See? See? It doesn't look yummy. Oh wait, I gotta put it up higher, guys. I'm sorry. I hope I got it up high enough. Ah, there you go. You can see it now. I can see. Yay! Isn't that beautiful? And it's delicious. But anyway, you can make you some just like this, you know. And you know what's good about cucumbers? They have a lot, a of, lot of juices in them, and they will definitely keep you hydrated. Along with your water, bring your water, okay, guys? I want you guys to stay well hydrated in this heat, okay? We all got to drink lots of water and make sure we have lots of fluids throughout the day in this heat wave, okay? And then you can always also have, like, vegetables and fruits that have a lot of juice in them. 
They keep you hydrated, which is a good idea too. See, isn't that a beautiful creation? You can see like the the cucumbers and the onions floating around with the pepper and stuff. See, it's really, really good. See, and then I just snapped the lid back on, see? And what I did, um, when I created this, I, I don't know if I may actually do it right now. I guess I'll do it. I was shaking it, see? Kind of like shake everything up. Make sure everything's shaked up really good, see? Shake, 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 shake it. Shake this. Shake this cucumbers and onions. They taste so good. They're yummy. They are good. And you know they're very good for hydration. Lots of, lots of, lots of um, juice in them. And they are really, really good. Really, really good. And healthy for you. And delicious for you. And I think you guys will like them. My mom used to make these all the time. Put them in the refrigerator. And I couldn't wait to eat them. So they would eat them before they were done. Like, kind of like I'm doing this right now. Because I made these just a little earlier. Let's get to let them, like, set in the refrigerator for, like, four hours or overnight. But with me, I couldn't hardly wait. Um, when I was a kid, and I couldn't hardly wait today because I wanted to show them to you guys, okay? Mmm. 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 See the onion? It tastes really good once the, um... Vinegar and the seasoning really gets four minutes in. Oh, it tastes even better. But it tastes like this. Onion. You guys like onion? Onion's good for you, too. It has a lot of good nutrition. Ready? Here's the onion. Okay, I'm going to eat it like this, guys. Mmm. 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 I can already taste the vinegar in it. But I've had them in there not too long. But they kind of, when they ferment, they get really, really flavorful, which is the best way. But if you're ready to eat, you want a snack, like when you're gone for the day, you're running around. And these help you keep you hydrated, which is a good thing, along with your water and your other hydrating drinks. Like, I like my iced tea, so I drink my iced tea. I like to keep water with me, too, because water's really good. Especially in the heat, we might not realize that. We're getting really hot, and we need to make sure we keep hydrated and feeling refreshed. Mmm. 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 Yummy, guys. And you know what I'm going to drink? A little bit of my tea to hydrate me. See? My tea, guys. I love my tea. See? My Lipton iced tea. I like it with ice. No sugar. I know some of you guys like sugar. My mom always liked sugar when she made it. But I like it without sugar. See, I'm hydrating. Yay! <laughs> okay, guys. You know, I like to try to be a little silly. Maybe not too much today. Okay, so we're going to finish eating my cucumbers. And then also, this is another, another good vegetable to grow in your garden. Make your homemade garden, garden at home, and they taste so fresh when they grow. And these plants, when you grow these, do them kind of the same way if you watch my other video about the squash that I just made. These cucumbers do the same thing. Like my dad, he used to put them, um, like, put like all the squashes and cucumbers, watermelons, cantaloupes. He'd make like a mound, like a hill for them. And then you make a trench around them. And um, you probably could do them in a row, too, if you wanted to. But these like the, they like the, they like the spread. So they kind of, kind of make long vines. And they have lots of cucumbers. And they bloom pretty blooms. And they bloom pretty quick. And you will have squash, um, not squash, I'm sorry. Think about them squash. Cucumbers before you know it. And lots of them. So you just, you know, do the same thing, mix some like um, gardening soil, potting soil or something in with the, the dirt, mix it up so it has plenty of nutrition to grow. And plant your seeds in there, put a little hole so you can put your seeds in there. Put like four seeds in each like little mound hill or whatever, unless you make a garden row, you know. You could do that too. And um, 
So like, if you're going to do the little mount of four seeds, unless you do the garden row, you know, with the trench on each side, you could make a whole row of them. Just put a seed maybe about, about four to six inches apart. And um, my dad used to put like four seeds in each little hole or so. And then bury them up. Water them really good because they like water, like a lot of water. Put water around the trench. Let it fill up. And it's easier too because you save your water that way. And they grow better. They get perlineated water. You don't have to worry about them. They like water. They like sun. And they will grow for you. And you know, you can go. Any hardware store has them. 99 cent stores have them sometimes. And uh, just let your garden. You can buy them online. And then you'll have beautiful cucumbers like these. And then you can make these some cucumbers like this. Or you can make them with salad too. Is really good. Or you can have them like this with salad. Or you can have them for a snack. You know, make the vinegar, water, uh, onion, cucumber slices. And put your pepper and your little bit of salt or seasoned salt. Whatever you prefer. And um, you can even take them on the go. You can put them in like a little plastic container like this. Or even like a little Ziploc baggie too. You could use that. You know, you could use this too. Put in your ice chest along with your water and your other drinks. Keep you hydrated. There you go. And these will keep you refreshed, hydrated, and ready to take care of stuff. Feeling good. Hmm. 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 Mm-hmm. Mm. So that one has a little onion too, guys. Where did the onion go? I think it's underneath it. But anyway, I'll show you another creation. I'll show you my solid creation. I got a good solid creation. I think you guys like it. We'll like it. And I have a good way to make those little baby carrots. I'll show you that too. But they are so good like that. I like raw carrots too. I like the little baby carrots especially. Or if you want the long ones, you could cut them up. But the baby carrots are already small. They're ready to go. They're in the bag. Just rinse them. And they're ready if you want them just like that. Or if you want to cook them. I got a good way where they taste really, really good cooked, okay? I'm going to share that with you guys too. I'll let you guys know some of my cooking ways, okay? I like to eat a lot of vegetables. I love my snack food too. But I eat everything in moderation, okay? Um, I love some of my snacks. Which if you guys watch those other videos, you'll see. I like cheesy stuff, flaming hot stuff. Oh, I just gave it away. <laughs> okay, you guys know what I like. And I like all kinds of different drinks. Um, favorite drinks right there. I just showed you guys that, right? And you know what it is, right? Right? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Right here, guys. Lift and iced tea. I love this drink. It's so refreshing. And it's Nice in the summertime, but I drink it all year long. It's nice all year long for me, but, but I know a lot of people like iced tea in the summertime. And a lot of people get it when they go to restaurants and stuff, but nothing beats homemade Lipton and iced tea. I'll tell you that right now. My mom used to get the grounds, but I buy the tea bags now. Then my mom started using the tea bags later. But um, this is really, really good. And I love it. Mm. And you guys will definitely have to try some iced tea. I don't know um, how you like it with sugar, without, I like it without sugar. And we're going to continue eating the cucumbers. We got one left. So I'm mixing it up. There's some vinegar right there and pepper and the seasoning. And so if you want to grow some, they're very easy to grow. Anybody can do it. It's very simple. Just give them some love and they'll grow beautiful for you. They love their water. They love their sun. And some gardening soil would help too. Mix it with the dirt. They like dirt too, but you know, make some more nutrition in the soil and they'll grow really, really good. And it's better to mix the dirt with it. That's what I've always said. I found it works really well. And you'll love your cucumbers. They have the cute little blooms. They're little tiny little blooms. Real tiny. And then they make this big cucumber. Yummy cucumbers. They have all kinds of different cucumbers. So you can see what kind you like to try. There's plenty of varieties. Uh, you can check where they have seed packs. Mmm. 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 
I just always remember when you plant them, they like to spread. They vine. They go vining. They go far. And, and you'll see what they do. Make sure they have room. If you're going to make the mounds in between or the... If you make the, um, the long trench, make sure they have room to move because they like to move a little bit. And, you know, in between the... If you make garden rows, you know, like like we've done that, do that too. Make room in between the garden rows because they will grow. Okay, guys, I finished my plate. We got the cucumber right there. And it was delicious. So... The other one I cut up, I got a little more to put in this container right here. There's a little bit left of it. But this cucumber is delicious. And I'm sure you guys will like it. It's very refreshing. It tastes good. It's healthy for you. Give it a try. Okay, guys? And see if you like my recipe, okay? And you know I don't know what to do. Get your cucumber. And what else do we got to do? We're going to put that right there, okay? We got to thumbs up to my video. Subscribe. And ring the bell for a notification so you can um, know when I upload new videos, which is going to be really soon. And I think you guys will like my next video, okay? I'm going to tell you about more vegetables too soon, okay? So if you want to make you like a vegetable garden or fruits, fruit trees are good to grow too, grapevines. There's all kinds of stuff. It's very easy to do. Once you get the hang of it, you'll be an excellent gardener. And you'll love your vegetable gardening, your fruit trees. And again, these are pretty easy to grow. Can you hear the noise? This one says, I am delicious. Okay, guys, I'll see you guys later, okay? Have a good day. Have a good cucumber day. Okay, and I will see you guys soon, okay? Bye-bye. Bye. Bye, guys. Bye. I'm going to let you guys go now.